Hello everyone, I'm back with another video on my third today and today I will uh, go through this PSLE Math 2022 fence question. My friends all say it's pretty difficult and I personally do think so. So without further ado, let's get started. So firstly, we want to do some annotation. Um, it says, the question says, 177 meters of fences we use to make the following figure. So. It says the breadths were identical, which means this equals to this, equals to this, equals to this, this, and this. And since the ones here are actually the same, um, they're the same, so we can actually f find out what's the breadth of e each and every single one of them. So the breadth will be 36 divided by 3 equal 36 divided by 3 equals to 12. So now we know that this is 12 cm, we label it. Now we want to find out what's the, the length of AB. So I feel that this is actually the part that's the most challenging and it says that all blue lines are fences actually in the real paper it was dotted lines but here in my picture it's blue lines so all of them are fences and one common mistake everyone makes is look at my red ink just count every th single thing in the outline and ignore the ones in green, which are this and this. And because they ignore the green thing, they feel that it is actually impossible to find out what the red is. Yeah, it actually is impossible, so you have to be very careful when you do this question. So, because it already has 27, I'll just erase my drawings here since you've already seen them. Um, accidentally erased something. The all blue lines are fences. I felt that was really important, so I didn't erase it. Okay. So we can just take this 27, which is the green, 27. And then this is X, this thing, which is AB. It's X, I'm gonna label it in red. And X again. And we can actually just push the blue lines out. Then it makes one nice line of length 36. We also have another 36. So now we just need to take 177 minus 36 minus 36 minus 27 minus 27 and that will give us 2x okay that will give us 2x and because 2x is double ab and it's also equals to 177 minus 36 minus 36 minus 27 minus 27 that gives us 51 and hence 2x as 2x equals 51 x we is basically 51 divided by 2 equals to 25.5 many people actually gave the answer as 20.5 but i actually feel that that was actually a very very common mistake and i'll go through it later on because 20.5 also has a pretty much significant role in this. So now we know that the length of AB is 25.5 cm. Oh, oh, sorry, it was meters, not centimeters. 25.5 meters. So I'll just erase my annotations since you've all understood it. And now we can replace x by 25.5. And so I will use this yellow ink to actually 
shape the topmost rectangle because although they have the same breadth, they have different lengths, which means that their areas are different. So this yellow one, as we uh, discovered earlier, the breadth is 12, so its area will be 12 times 25.5. And that will give us 306. And now we know that as the bottom one in green, just right in green, is has a length of 27. Okay, the green font doesn't look nice. Uh, 27. So we take 27 times its breadth of 12. That will give us 27 times 12, which is 324. Overall, I felt that th the difficulty of this paper was similar to P3, P4 of Math yeah. Olympiad, and I feel that anyone can ace this with line colors. You don't, you don't need to be a math genius to be able to do most of the questions in this paper, but you just have to be very careful. So we need to know the area of the red rectangle here, which I'm drawing now, and that will be 876 minus 306 minus 324. Okay? And that will give us 26, uh, 246. Sorry about that. And now we just take 246 divided by its um, breadth of 12. And that will give us a length of 20.5. See where that number just mysteriously came in? Yeah. So now we can just delete these drawings. Oops. We can just delete these drawings. And now we know that since its length was 20.5, this area I will now mark in black this length will be 27 minus 10.5 I, I mean 20.5 and that will give us 6.5 and now 25.5 minus 20.5 that will give us 5 so the perimeter of this figure, the entire figure, not the whole fence, is basically like what I uh, drew in red earlier. The one which I said many people made a mistake. It's basically 36 plus 36 plus 25.5 plus 5 plus 6.5 plus 27. Correct me if there are any mistakes. And I feel that if you did this correctly, you should be able to arrive at this stage where the answer is 136. I hope you guys got this question right. If yes, congratulations. If no, well, I'm sure that you have actually done the best you can. Good luck for your remaining examinations and your PSLE uh, for your mother tongue and your science. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like, uh, enjoy it and you find my tutorials helpful, don't forget to give a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.